Hey everybody and welcome to part 9 of Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage. Today we'll be going to the level known as Magma Cone. Almost finishing up the game. This will probably get us to the second last world, or the last world with the last few levels. That's pretty cool. Wow, dude. I believe these guys are like the partiers of the Spiral Universe. What are you guys anyway? Fawns, right? Looney the Fawn. Do you have a Toonie? Because for some reason in Canada we named our money after the Looney Tunes. I swear, man. Now, Loonies and Toonies are just such a weird name for money. I like our money. Because it, you know, has cool animals on it, but still, it's just such a weird name. It does not sound like real money. Plus, now that we have plastic money like Mexico, it, a lot of people don't think our money's real. They call it Monopoly money, but Monopoly money is plastic. Could have called it that when, you know, it was paper, but not anymore. So what we have to do is we have to push those guys on the axes. Fairly simple. Hopefully we can finish off this, this, uh, this entire world in this episode. Okay, so all our gems are just up here. You can see that gem through the ground, that was funny. Like the blue gem over there. Don't know why it was like that, but it was. I like the music here. It's like... Hey, listen to that, the soundtrack is awesomely weird. Oh, you just had to make money fall down there, didn't you? Uh, I'll be back for you, money. Money, honey. Okay. Let's see, we have to go back up here. Two of three orbs are actually found from Hunter. And the other one is a weird, annoying flying challenge. But, eh. Whatever. Ah, you can actually hit me through there. Good. It's not one of those games where they can hit you through a surface, but yet you can't. I hate games like that. It's just unfair. Goodbye, sir. Like how hey, you guys uh, look like you do all the work. I deal, I deal with all the smacking them around. The guy could have killed me. It wasn't going to hurt you. Where do they, all these lava shapers come from? Magma shapers? Magmatic lava shapers. Anyways, here's another bottle rocket. Hmm. Sweet. Less than 200 gems remain. Hey, you got a jackhammer. Ooh, that looked like it was in such a painful position, too. And all these random small gems just sitting here. Oh, I see where we're supposed to go now. Is that the way up? Yeah, that's the way up. I gotta do some more backtracking. Oh, and by the way, money bags actually... Ouch! Money bags actually shows up again here. It'll, it's a long time since we've seen him, but he's here. Hunter's also here again, but everyone likes Hunter. Hunter's an awesome cheetah. That apparently needs running shoes. Makes them sound kind of useless, don't you think? Oh, great, the music is done. It's kind of funny when the music actually loops to the point where there's no soundtrack left. Now we're in here. This part is kind of weird. So now what we have to do is we have to do this twice, but we have to collect crystals. Difficulty 3. Grab 10 crystals before Hunter. You have to watch for the smoke and it'll actually lead you to where the crystals are. So yeah, this is all just like a, a luck game pretty much. It does have some skill to it, but not much. Mainly luck. Ah, oh, we got that without even trying to get it. 
Wow, I missed that. How? Stop grabbing them. I can't see any. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. My orb hunter. I'll give you Let me guess. Five star challenge. Yeah, grab 15 crystals, because grabbing an extra 5 makes it that much harder, right? See, we can actually stand on it, he doesn't, so that gives us the benefit. Ah, you're not gonna get that, dude. He hasn't even grabbed one yet. Oh, dude, that was... You cheated, I swear! Dude, can you stop? Thank you. Ah, I stole right out of under his nose, man. Wait, how did we not get that? I don't even know how I got that one. Dude, I keep running into him. Almost got that one. Not even trying, but... Woohoo! Whoa, whoa, wait. How is he catching up? Wait, how is he... How is he ahead? Wait, how the hell did he do that? Like, how did he fucking get ahead of us? Thank you. I guess I was, like, so cocky that... Whoa! Whoa! Great. Sorry, dude, but you're not getting that. Fuck you. Damn you, Hunter! Like, I don't get why I have to beat him to get the, the orbs. Like, can't he just give me his damn orbs? Why do I actually need to work to get them from him? Dude, you were very delayed with that. Don't know what you were trying to do, but... Those confused me with the positioning they were going at. There, we destroyed him that time. Like, I don't know why the first time was so difficult. Alright, so... With that, let's leave. Weird little icy crystalline cave in the middle of a volcano. So it makes me question how those fa how that fawn got hit by a volcanic rock if this volcano does not have any um lava in it. I don't know. I honestly don't know. This game makes no sense sometimes. Oh no, it's Mooney Bags. AKA Greedy the Bear. There's lives there, plus there's three lives right here. It's like, do you really think I'm gonna die that many times in this level game? Well, we're now 30 lives. Let's grab these gems before we ask money bags. Well, if it isn't my yeah, 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 I'll pay you 200 gems to take the damn elevator. Thank you. Really didn't want to, but let's do it. Woohoo! Just fall off. Literally, you just pay him to move it out of the way. Plus, if you want to go back up, but... You don't necessarily need it to go back up, because if you collected everything, then you don't need to go back up. Whoa! What the hell was that? Random boulder! Oh god, we almost died. And just after I was doing the whole spiel on get good... Okay, good. There's nothing here. <laughs> nothing here that can get us, at least. Doom. 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 And I'm not saying, like, Dune is in, like, the sand. And... Okay, there's no boulder there, apparently. It's a little weird to have, like, such a big gap without any threats. So your main, like, course of action here is literally just to hop left to right. Until he closed the volcano that apparently was inside a volcano. Thanks 
Hey, Bippo, I don't really care about your parting shenanigans. Give me the magma cone talisman. Alright. Now, let's see. This last little part is going to be annoying, especially since these guys can kill you. Oh, wait. For what the hell, game? I forgot, actually, I do have to go and talk to him, though. Pop! And... Pop! Woohoo! Oh, wait, more health came back. Sweet. Hey, there's a random whirlwind up now. Wait, poo, I missed... I missed, uh... I missed a balloon somewhere, didn't I? Ah, oh, there it is. There we go. 100%. So now all we have to do is get up here. Talk to this guy to trigger the um, lava monsters that spawn. There we go. Those damn monsters. Now, these things can only be defeated by using lava rocks. Because... That's the way life rolls, right? Defeat a lava monster using things from the lava. Yeah, they don't actually hurt you, but they do fucking knock you into the fucking lava, you little jackass cheater. Blah. Great, there's two of them together. They're plotting world domination. Okay, apparently that didn't work. Apparently, I need to go back up and get some more flight. So I swear it runs out faster when you're actually doing the challenge. And going through there apparently didn't activate. Oh, you fucking little cheating asshole. Well, we have our first death because, guess what? He double attacked us. Oh, and um, apparently we spawned down here because we got close to her. Where the fuck is the whirlwind? Sorry you screwed us over, lady. Now I gotta do this all over again. Woohoo! Thank you, you're dead. Now where's the next one? There you are. Nope, that didn't work. Yeah, there's 12 of these bastards. There's a lot of these creatures. Haha, uh -huh, your party's over. Yeah. Let me guess. One in here. Well, let's grab some more wingage. So apparently it's not doing... Oh, there it goes. I swear I wasn't doing the whole countdown thing there. I'm like, seriously? You're not gonna do that? That was weird. My volume went funny as soon as I hit him. I don't care if I take the damage. At least the last two are outside. One's right here, then the other one's over the other way. Oh! You lava monster dick. Oh, there he is. Why are you kidding me? I'm invincible, bitch. Apparently, I cannot be destroyed by lava rocks. Even though that is clearly the only way you can stop me. Fuck you, fucker. You know what? You know what? I hate you, so die! And that- why did that shoot like that? These things are like more like rockets than anything. There we go. Thanks, but... Uh, I just came from my orb. And we're out of here. Oh god, fawns are assholes. They throw each other in the lava. 
man. Should have had an extra 200 bucks there, but no. Moneybags took it all. And now for these last levels, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to speed through them. And why? Because we cannot get 100% on a lot of stuff. So no point in, you know, taking more time than it's needed. Nah, 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 nah. So our main goal is flame these plants and get him to destroy the doors. So we're just gonna speed rush this. We're not even gonna bother with like the orbs or anything yet. Because we just wanna get this out of the way. Hey buddy, what's up? And then we'll have challenges to, you know, um challenges. Well, at least, yeah, mini challenges to get the uh, doors open for him, you know, to get to the fruit on the trees. Apples, I assume. Which I think they're berries, but they're more like apples. At least in my opinion, they're more like apples. Don't know what kind of apples or like berries grow like apples, but sure. You just die. I don't even know why I'm bothering collecting these things, but... It's just like I have a hard time leaving them behind. They need to go into my wallet. Hey, little punk. Hey, give me the health. Thank you. There are a lot of enemies here, I swear. Die, fool. Die, other fool. You couldn't defeat her yourself, Mr. Hippo. Damn genies. You're not the genie from Aladdin either, that was awesome. Oh, you can run past him, but you can't run past the girl. Okay, now you can run past her. Weird. I don't get your logic behind things, dude. But apparently his logic is it can only run through certain things. Ow, get out of the way, dude. Stupid asshole. Oh, apparently I got him. Woohoo! 20 enemies without even trying. So yeah, there's one of the orbs and stuff, but we'll, we'll be back later. And here's our talisman. A lamp. Well, let's leave before we get too attached to this level. See ya. Oh my god, guys, he's a fat pig who ate everything. Go figure. 164. Not very many, but still enough. We'll have a long backtracking session next episode. Okay. That just leaves the least liked level in this world, Fracture Hills. So let's go to the Scottish theme level. Do 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 do. Yeah. Apparently they hate the bagpipes, and this music is actually Idle Springs music. Just to let you guys know. You guys probably already knew that, though. Yeah, and all they do is play music. And blow up in the castle. Thank you. Thank you for releasing me. We're not very important characters, because we're all named satyrs, but... That's just the way life rolls. When you're one of us. I already went in there. Why am I in there? There's another one. And it actually makes the pigs dance. 
See? The pigs actually dance. Hey, piglet. Uh, I'm just trying to collect some of the money, you know? Well, hey, you're an enemy. Ooh. You're also an enemy. And you. Oh, let me guess. Too bad your bees didn't get me. I always used to get stung by those bees, but now I don't. Third one. Three remaining. Boop, boop. Ow, like, I honestly don't know how to stop their bee. Can- Oh my fucking god, he's not dying. Did you guys see that? My flame literally did absolutely nothing to the guy. Damn immunity. Second last one? Hey, nice tail, dude. My money. Oh, come on, game, really? I need that pig. Second last one. Oh, the next one will blow up in the entrance. Only one more satyr to rescue. So we're able to kill him. I need supercharged to get in there, but like I said, when we do our backtracking session, since we can't complete these levels yet, we'll uh, do that. Whoa, I didn't think you were an alive one. And here's the final one. Now that we have... yeah. I know, man. I know. I'm the best in all of the land. We actually have to take this pathway. It doesn't actually lead you right to the castle. You actually have to go up here. And now we have all these gems. Just chilling here. And the lady who gives us our talisman. Oh. oh. Yeah, they're whiny teenagers. But here's our panpipe. And let's leave. I know we missed a lot though, but whatever. So yeah, they just start dancing. And 163. 4,227. Now we should be able to take on the boss in this episode as well. Well done, Spyro. Now that you bring him on. Yeah, I know. I don't know why they actually tell you that you have to jump down, but yeah, we kind of assume that. Gulp. Gulp. We finally made Avalar ours. <laughs> You've earned this special reward. Now. Oh, what is it, boy? Oh, the fairy. Here you go. You singed my cape. Dragon, you are really starting to get on my nerves. Say goodbye, flame breath. Go. Lunch time. Go. Finish him off and you can all the fairies you can eat. I'm going to enjoy this. He is so sadistic. But then again, he is an evil leader, so can't expect much else from him, can you? So this boss has a lot more health. And apparently I couldn't get away. I don't know why that was. But the birds will actually drop in stuff. You know those birds that we've seen from... Um, Skilo's Badlands. Yeah, you can only hit him once before he actually resets all the barrels. Well, all the eggs. Because it always drops the same thing. A bomb. La Bomba. There we go. Okay, gulp. Bring it, bitch. That was it? Ha! Huh. You attempted to shoot me, but it was all in vain. He watches them come in, he's like, ah, oh, get out of here, you damn birds. Ow. 
Blow them up, please. Perfect. Can you please send in some sheep? I could really use some sheep because of my stupidity. Sheep? Sheep? Or chickens. Chicken's fine. Chicken probably tastes better than sheep anyway. Oh, come on! Whoa, what the hell was that? I got launched over here. Like, I was running really fast. Boom! Oh, good. He doesn't kill off the chicken. <laughs> that was weird, though. This boss fight is actually not that difficult. It, it's long. That's about it. Not long and hard. Come on, bro. Just come body slam. I think I prefer your body slam over this attack. This attack, you just shoot more and more as time goes on. Are you fucking kidding me, Gulp? Screw off, man. That's a dick move. Love the boss music, though. The instrumentals are nice. Do -do 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 Hopefully that hit some. Good, that did. One health remaining. Come and get some. Big green ball of lard. And guess what? Boom! Oh, he crushed our head. Gulp. Defeated. No! Yes, we saved this kingdom. Lyra, you did it. Whoa. Alora, where'd you come from? I was just outside the castle in Autumn Plains. The castle is now free again. There's no sign of Ripto. And since you've been around... The creatures of Avalar are finally starting to get along. Since you've done so much for Avalar, and since I know you really miss being on vacation, we really wanted to do something nice for you. It's not much, but we hope you like it. Wow, this is great. Aren't you going to join me? Uh, no. I'd like to, but I've got to go check on the professor in the winter tundra. He's still trying to fix the super portal so we can send you home. Oh. That sounds interesting. I think I'll just hang out here for a while and soak up a few rays. Yeah, he's tired. Uh, hey, where'd Laura go? I better follow her. Dude, she just told you where she was going. In Winter Tundra. I think I've finally come up with a way to access the Dragon Worlds from the Super Portal. This power crystal should give us the extra boost that we need. Just a few more calculations to set it up. I think I have it. Excellent! Everything is finally ready. We're going to need a lot more orbs, but with the power crystal boosting it, the super portal should work again. So, you thought you had gotten rid of me. Well, I'm afraid not. I persuaded that fat bear money bags to sell me a few bomb. Quick, the power crystal. Don't even try it, book boy, or you'll be the world's smartest pile of ashes. <coughs> this is just what I need for a new scepter. Hunter, do something quick. Uh, hey, give that back. Well, I tried. <laughs> you little fools! After I destroy you all with my new scepter, I'm going to rename this place Riptonia! Well, money bags is a dirt bag, and Hunter apparently is a useless cat. So anyways, that does it for this episode. In the next episode, we will do Winter Tundra and do a lot of backtracking. So I'll see you guys then. Peace out.